Hi, Connie Murphy. Well, decided to go for a walk after I finished doing the pin curls. And uh, so I thought I'd start the video with this little frame first. Good morning, good morning. It's nice to see you all. Hello, everybody. This is Connie Murphy, over 70, still working on being glamorous. <laughs> well, I haven't made a video for almost two weeks. Uh, I had the swelling of my eyes because of all the... Uh, beautiful flowers that are growing out in the backyard and uh i'll have to squeeze in that picture of the little insect that i saw out in my backyard I never saw one before and got a lot of information on it evidently uh it preys on tarantulas so it was a pretty big kind of looks like a fly i'll show you that next uh anyway so today i'm just going to do my pinkles from beginning to start smaller sections starting from the top and uh, I have a less hair on each, each pin curl, so it will be cooler hopefully when it dries. Now I started at 12 and I finished about 12.25. Okay, so here we go. Yeah, here's that insect. It's pretty big, much bigger than a fly, probably 10 times bigger than a fly. I found out that he likes tarantulas but if you get stung oh boy it's a pretty bad one so while i'm showing you this i may well as well I'll give you a little information about it number one look but don't touch because the sting is one of the worst for uh this kind of an insect uh it will really sting you but like i said it has the most painful electrifying, as they described it, uh, feeling. Uh, they're mostly from the desert, and they're, one of their habitats is in the uh, sidewalls of the Grand Canyon in Arizona, uh, where all the tarantulas are, because the, that is their favorite feeding. Now, I haven't seen any tarantulas in my backyard, and I hope I don't, but like I say, I'll just have to watch if there's any kind of confrontation between this guy and a tarantula because I'm definitely not going to touch them unless I kill them both at the same time. Anyway, it's called a hawk wasp. Another name for it is uh, Pepsini, P-E-P-S-I-N-I. -E -I. And uh, no, it's not the Asian hornet that's been on the news the last couple of days. So uh, that's about it. You can check it out for yourself on, you know, Google it. Okay, so let's start with the pin curls. I'm going to start on the top here. Mainly just to get it out of the way. My bangs, that, are, that is. There we go. I put I put the pin on one end, and maybe later I'll put another one to hold the other end down. This is the mousse that I use, Super Hold, bought it from 99 cent store, and it works really well. So I only put a little bit on, then I'm gonna just kind of add a little water to each strand of hair that I pull out. Okay, so here I'm getting towards the that part of my crown on my head. And uh, I'll turn around in just a little bit. And you can see that the pin curls are actually, don't ever interrupt me, Connie. <laughs> These pin curls are a lot neater. I'm looking at my arms and uh, my muscles have gotten a little bit smaller because I'm taking my mom out of bed only once or twice a week now because she's just getting really heavy. And I think I mentioned before that my arms were starting to get sore. Sore because, you know, you can only do so much lifting with your arms before they start causing you pain. So it is helping a lot which was another problem. I had the past two weeks that, you know, 
my body was sore. So I took a break. Okay, I'm gonna curl this forward in the corner here. And as you can see, I haven't colored my hair for oh, two or three weeks. I don't think Bonnie had, well, no, she hadn't either. And uh, she'll probably come over and learn a little bit. Maybe she'll go for a walk with me. If not, uh, I might ride my bike. So I'm almost done with this hair set. go corner back I think that other corner that I'm coming into uh, I'll be coloring forward also The family's all doing well. My husband is still home with us. Oh, but my dad, I may have had to redo another one here. Yeah, I did. Most likely got it caught on an end of a bobby pin. Darn, darn, double darn. Okay, so wherever there might be one little popping up, I'll put a uh, bobby pin there, a small one, like that one. Like I said, I'll be uh, looking to see how it comes out. Little bobby pin to hold it down. And these really are not bad to lay on. I don't have a problem with them at all. I may or may not have a scarf covering my hair, I don't know. But anyway, that takes care of that. So I remembered that I had a pink scarf and that's what I'll put on my head. It's kind of a long one. Put it on top, just wind it in the back. I don't tie it in a knot and bring it around to whatever side I feel like wearing on, wearing it on that particular day. Like I said, I'll be going outside and I like to have my ears covered or cotton in my ears. So this serves two purposes. <laughs> and I will be taking care of that. My hubby always gets a kick out of seeing what I'm up to when he walks into the room or whatever. <laughs> okay, so I'm going to let it dry. So fixing that little corner pink curl right now. I don't want to have any fish hooks, as we call them in the beauty industry. And I've been wondering if I'm going to renew my license this year. It's only $50 a year. But I'm thinking uh, I probably won't be going back to work in the hair industry. So I've got to make a decision on that by the middle of next month, June. So here I just put on a, my uh, jacket and uh, some little white earrings. Okay. 
and I'm ready to go out or on the bicycle whatever Bonnie decides and as you can see we decided to go for a walk almost at the end of our walk that's it okay so that's it <laughs> oh, at least I had something to record even though probably most of you only spent a minute and a half to two minutes watching the video but gave me something to do gave you something to watch if you wanted to for all you new people hello uh if you first time visiting just the press a button little bell up on the uh, right hand corner of your computer and um, it'll let you know when i come back on again uh, with another posting so take care everybody uh enjoy the weather stay safe and uh, don't forget that young gal inside of you. Bye.